Hello! Welcome. Here we are. And we're going full on tinker time. There is a strategy to be done. And said strategy is all about said tinker. So we're gonna tinker with the tinker, so to speak. I think we can maybe set up sneaky expansion. We can't build them. You can and you will. Don't deny me. So, this Ancient of War is going to... Hello there. Come over here and creep. That was a lot of urgent pinging, I must say. It was very urgent. Very serious. Missany? Okay. Here's my human ally over here. Captain Ping on the west hand side. And for Klempt. An expert at human play is over there. So... We now have the setup for the Tinker. Moonwell into Altar after Moonwell is done. That allows for the neutral hero. We can send off a Wisp soon. But not too soon because we still need to get Moonwell and Archer. There you go. This one coming out. Then you're going to get Archers from here. And careful with the green camp on that side. Because it will aggro. Your building is complete. And that'll do. Yeah, I won't even mention that. That's none of your business. So, more moon wells would be appreciated. Allow for the wood. And then it's all good. Bring this cheeky chap. It's a bit uncomfortable. I wonder if we could have built maybe over here. Because there's no trees on this side. For him to get to before he essentially pulls aggro. Tinker time. Said for the tinker. I could just use a lot of wisps to repair instead. It's going to cost a bit of lumber, but it might be the best way around. Otherwise, he's going to take so long to get all the way down there. So I think I'm just going to bite the bullet on that one. So, yeah, a lot of wisps to repair then. Uh, Tinker's tanking a little bit. Saves me some repair damage. I'm loving that bloodlust though. That's really going to help out. Looking forward to that. Tinker's taking a beating. These guys are tough when they get bloodlusty. Quite strong and died. Alright. Down there. Round here. Go get yourself. You continue to tank. That's fine. You can come and eat, actually. You're not going to die to those, I don't think. So come over there, eat. Continue with the wisps, because Night Elf, like, they just love the freaking lumber. And that'll do. Crack on. Crack right on. Should be able to get tech in a moment. Tech, off you go. Come back. Let the little dude do the tanking, if he can. You have a nibble. I'm going to put like a moon well over there as well. Bit of flexibility with the moon wells. Spread them out. That'll do, pig. Archer can come over. You can have a little drink. We're going to go Hunter's Hall. Might go for some bears and dryads. It'll be a bit more interesting. At least initially to start off with. And we'll see where the game goes from that point onwards. Green is very heavily pushing on yellow over here. He's got a very large army. Don't you, Green? Yes. I'll come in to help. Backstab from behind. Blue's going to do the same. Chase them down. I got nothing better to do. Good save of the archers. Wow, we're all gathered. Don't know if this creek camp is too tough for us to do, but we can try it. Mr. Ping thinks we can do it. I'm game. Yellow's not game, though. Gonna have to focus that air pretty hard. Oh, there's a nice reward there. So... 
Yeah, I'll focus on my archers. Yellow has come on board. Let's go with the damage. That and that. You get some more wisps. I don't know we definitely need that many. Yellow's coming in for the steel. Ring of protection plus five is really good for either of us. I'll take it before... Well, I would... I don't mind. Either one of us. Me or the Mountain King. As long as Yellow doesn't pick it up with his Archmage. Yellow's getting uh, a bit bullied. Tech is almost complete. Cut that down. Let's go one over here. Pull over. I'm not going to provide much of an impact here. Until I get myself built up properly. Alright, well that'll do. <laughs> yes. So, pull over a couple of wisps for our ancients. Nice. Got level 3. You go. Orange is very keen on that position. What about loads of dryads? We've got a pretty early expansion. Very well established position at this point. Loads of mana. Let the tinker do what the tinker does. Leveling up quite nicely. Maybe we can get level 6. Siege away, my boy. Siege away. Uh, dryads and that are not available yet. More upgrades. Let's have a look and see. Yellow could do with some gold. That'll help him rebuild. Bit of lumber for blue. Otherwise, we could check wisps for... I think I need more wisps in the grand scheme of things. No shredder to be had. Johannes is uh, responsible for this strategy, by the way, but I haven't even had a chance to actually read it out. He doesn't like that Archmage. No one likes Yellow in this game. Pretty hateful towards Yellow. Watch out, Huntress. That looks like a bad fight for you. Ah, my archer. I thought I was, that's what I was looking for. I was looking for my archer. Because <laughs> I sent her back, but I took her off my hotkey so I wouldn't mess her up. But the undead was having his way. Is this suicide? What a journey! What an adventure! Marvellous. Oh, that green camp does love to aggro. Wow! Yay, save the art dryad, save the world. Orange is kind of giving up now. His work is done. So much piercing damage there. Pound cake is down for the count. Pound that cake. Pound it good. Looks like I need more armor. Good levels for the tink. Let's go put some pressure on. Sidriads. Yeah. 
Waiting for the Death Knight to just turn up and coil me. Bunch of necromancers over there. Wee wee, wee wee, wee wee, wee wee, wee wee, wee wee. Yellow's in trouble now. My champion yellow. Well, it's a bit of a suicidal TP, but he's basically dead. So I'm going to TP over and hope he doesn't pay attention to my tinker. Run him away immediately, but let my dryads fight. So at least that can help him a bit whilst he's under pressure. What a bully. Oh, so much focus on the poor hero. Yellow. Save yellow. It's like nothing. Blue's completely destroyed over here. I thought these guys were pros. Downside of Micron with Dryads is, is a lot of the time, even if you pull them back, they're going to still die. Strongest creep might be the Hydra, or the Maiden that can steal units. So we've completely lost blue, and yellow's basically like been dead light since the start of the game. So this is a two versus four at best. And none of the enemy bases are down. So, I'm not looking, not feeling too confident about this one. A lot of hero focus. It's fine. Oh, 
Everyone's running. System, go. I'm all geared up. Engine's running. Hi. What is nature's call? Our warriors have engaged. What you got? Let's roll out. So I can fight one versus two at least, but I don't know how Orange is doing versus his two. Frostworms, so OP. They still affect the Tinker. That is so OP. That Frost Breath is ridiculous. What is nature's call? All systems go. Are we being invaded? Great outdoors. I'm on top of it. What you got? The hunt's gone. I'm on top. What you got? I'm all geared up. What is nature's call? All systems go. I'm glad. It's running. What you got? I'm all geared up. It's running. All systems go. What is nature's call? Bye bye, yellow. Unless I can TP. Ah! Bugger! Can't reach the thing from there. Sell that, unfortunately. Nice. Yeah. Oh, did he leave? He's just shared with me, but he's not actually there. You gotta rebuild, man. If only I could be everywhere at the same time. Don't think I can, though. Hi. Orange. Gotta spend that orange. Use your gold. We need it, son. I mean, I've got a fair bit of gold, but I'm gonna go blast on two, uh, over a hundred food, I think, soon. Alright, well, that's one way to use it. Poor Yellow's just gonna get keep keep getting beaten up. Yeah, Yellow's like I mean, no matter how many times you try to save Yellow, he's just gonna keep dying over and over. That's obvious. It's just like consistently repetitively dying. Tranquility now.
I think we're just still fighting versus so bloody much. It's ridiculous. They really need to balance this game better so that we're not like in constant two versus fours and rubbish, honestly. Alright. Can't really say fairer than that. I think that's end game. I don't see where we come back from that. It's just too much. I mean, I've got expansions, but we're just kind of smashing our head against a brick wall at the moment. And have been for like a long time. Yeah, he went Divine Shield first. Of course he did. So yeah, yellow's like complete dead weight. Blue's is dead weight. Come on, stop moving, stop blocking the way. Like, you're literally useless, dude. Uh, he's soaking up the moon juice with the dryads, which is a shame because they soak up more because of their mana. So the mountain giants aren't going to get a look in. Well, at least they're probably running out of their main resources. But I think we're just running out. How much further can we go here? Can't really give lumber, but whatever. Poor Tinker's got like no mana though. Shouldn't get too trigger happy there. Wow, we actually pulled this one through. That what an epic game. That was a two versus four. I mean like two point seven five versus four maybe, but basically. For all of these pinging, Orange did a really good job. Would not have been able to do that otherwise. Yeah. 
geared up. Your building is complete. Your building is complete. All systems go. All systems go. What you got? Are we being invaded? I'm all geared up. The engine's running. Yeah, baby. Oh, there was only one archer. I thought it was a full creek camp. <laughs> I thought was, I liked to look one glance and I saw a unit there, so I figured it was just like a full creek camp. Just bloody one. Could have probably killed that with a wisp. Jeez. Can always transfer your trees to another expansion, but not too worried about that. Let's wipe out more expansions. Right. Right. That sets him up. We only need to kill the... I don't. I think we could probably beat them if we went to their base. But since we've worked so bloody hard on this, we may as well just focus on the uh, economy side of it, which is just destroy their gold mines that are currently available right now. That is a lot of units, though. Good thing we've got mountain giants to just try to distribute as much damage as they've got loads of units. I'm just going to spam the hell out of mountain giants and focus. Dryads are good at focusing frostworms down, so we've got that going for us. So just do that, and their power should decline over time. Goblin Tinker down. All systems go. There you go. That's it. Like, what can they do? But they did put up a fight, but damn. Tranquility is so MVP. It's ridiculous how good that spell is. Like, great! Look at it. It's available again. It's so ridiculously good. And he's got the heal as well from the Tinker. I mean, um, Alchemist. Should be one left now. Inza. <laughs> the lever did like har harass them, but. They still mash the griffins and stuff with him. One lever first is two very new, inexperienced allies. What's that, Mr. Tank? There you go. Mr. Tink. I can actually read out what the strategy is now. Johannes says, go for a Tinker and pimp him out good. Remember that he's an intelligence hero. Strange but true. He's a brawny intelligence hero. He's got the Ring of Protection plus 5, Belt of Giant Strength plus 6, Robe of the Magi, of course Orb for the Anti-Air, and a Snazzy Wand of Lightning Shield because he likes to look cool. That's his Pimp Kane. GG. Hopefully you enjoyed this. If you did, thumbs up, subscribe, share. Good stuff. 247 units killed. 217, because we're against skeletons, but damn. For both of us to have, like, over 200 units killed.
<laughs> it's crazy. I produced 342 units somehow. It's obviously the Clockwork Goblins, that one then, isn't it? And that's the uh, Skeletons. 18 hero kills! What? Shame I couldn't get any more experience. And we got the gold, whilst our other two down here had a combined amount of gold that was less than the lowest on their team. GG! That was a hard-fought game.